I recently got involved in the Cassette Culture subreddit, and I ended up getting a hold of some uh, blank mixtapes, or uh, blank cassette tapes that I ordered off of Amazon. And I got involved in the mixtape exchange. I made a mixtape, sent it off, got one in, in, in return. Let's take a look and see how all that went down. So I'm working on the, the J card, and I have this test printing. So when I stuff the J sleeve, the J card, it does work. We've got this kind of overage here. It sticks out by about a half inch. These are cases. Um, I want to see if, if these have the same issue. Yeah, see, those are much better. Look at that. So that's it. It's all set. We've got side A and side B. This has a, a track list that takes advantage of it. These were about 43 and a half minutes per side. If I were to do something differently next time, one thing that I did was I burned each side onto a CD. This is the side A CD, and this, and the side B CD is in there. And that's what I used for the dub. Um, instead of doing that, what I would do is take each song and dump it into Audacity. That way I could sort of uh, um, balance out the volume levels. And then I used uh, the old label maker here. And I printed out some stickers. But this is the... Uh, this is for the, the mixtape exchange. The boombox was the best that I had to do the dub. At the time, I thought it was all I could get my hands on, so I packed it up and sent it out that way. And then, like two nights later, this happened. So, I just went on my first Craigslist mission ever, uh, and I bought a tape deck for 25 bucks. 25 bucks is a tape to tape, had two reels. Looks like it's in good shape. Uh, I didn't see any of the buttons broken, but we'll see. I'm, on, I'm working on getting it home right now. And we'll test it out and see how she runs. So, my mixtape has shown up. Mixtape exchange. Let's see how it goes. All right. Hey, Alex. Hope you enjoy. Thank you very much. Ha, ah, look at that. That's sweet. That doesn't look printed. Did you draw that? That's pretty awesome. We've got a uh, little synth, a little electro. Also a 90 minute tape. Let's see if this is drawn. That's awesome. She drew that herself. That's so cool. Thank you so much. Oh, look at that. A real track list, a proper track list unlike the one I put together. That's very cool. Thank you so much. No insert. <laughs> All right, let's see. Oh, wait a second. That's a type two tape. She has got me beat. Big money. There we go. Uh, crank this up a little bit. Ah. That's dope. Thank you so much. I'm going to cut this off before I get copyright striked. So that was the Cassette Culture Mixtape Exchange. This is what I made right here, and I made a second one so that I could keep one. And this is what I got. <laughs> I made a Type 1, and she sent a Type 2. And uh, I kept her note on there, but uh, I think I, I think she's got me beat. But it, it, was, uh, it was a really awesome experience. And Jacqueline, for watching, thank you so much. Well, all right, boys and girls, my... Uh, my setup is evolving, I got some new equipment, and I've learned a lot about making a quality dub, so hopefully I can do this again and make one that sounds better. If you like these cassette culture videos, uh, let me know because I had a blast making this. It, it would be fun to make some more. So yeah, definitely tell me if there's any kind of audience for it. You guys have a good one.
So that's how the mixtape exchange went. Uh, Jacqueline, if you're out there, I hope you enjoyed the uh, um, the Anne Margaret uh, synthwave synth pop mix. I liked it enough that I made a second one for myself. Um, but hopefully in the future, now that, ooh, now that I have the tape deck, uh, I, I can make the dubs a little bit uh, a little bit better. Focusing on doing anything I can to uh, to get that dub quality as high as possible. Uh, which I think in the future might mean type 2 tapes as well. Well, all right, boys and girls, that's it for me. I'll see you in the next one.